was um, like. Yeah, when I spoke with Gary, he wanted um, Gary Mullen to come down and do a presentation. I thought he meant tonight, and he meant it to join me, which we did not schedule yet, so I'm not sure. Is there any certain days it's better or evenings it's better for you guys? Or? It's a bad time of the year to try to schedule in Christmas. First part of the week for Miami, Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, you know, as opposed to Friday, so Thursday, Friday. 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 Thursday, Uh, so that's that's a good thing. Um, on the wastewater plants, um, cost of date we're around nineteen million uh, two hundred eighteen thousand five sixty four. That's roughly about ninety nine percent done. So I think there's just a little under a hundred thousand left. Um, they are for the most part substantially complete. We haven't signed those documents. There's um, one process that hasn't uh, officially had started up yet. And that's on this. Um, uh, sludge uh, thickening process in our RDT unit. Uh, I hope to have that um, start up here within the week. Um, last month they got a lot of their site work done. Uh, paving was done. Right now they've got a crew of only about four or five working down there now, just working basically on punch list items. We have developed a punch list for the entire project. Um, and they are, I think they uh, work on about half of those items complete. So, um, the, as was with the water plant, the, the, the bulk of the remaining work is with the INC and some of their sub consultants. So, that's going to um, probably drag into next year. I don't anticipate a long time into next year, so hopefully, we'll have that. Um, those work through here in the next uh, 30 to 45 days. So. Um, other than that, everything is working down there pretty well. Like I said, we're still working through some of the punch list items and some, we're working on the problems going to be some of the punch list items are, are weather dependent, so we're going to have to maybe either put those down as warranty items and they'll have to come back in the spring and, and fix as well. So. Um, on the water plants, you guys approved the final papers last month. Um, I got the final review of the rec hydraulics and they're going to be printed this week so I will get copies back to the city on that and along with getting the O&M manuals we're uh, working on getting those complete. So those are the only two items left in that project as well. <laughs> those are things that I owe the city, we owe the city. So. Um, on the Flat Rock water line, uh, we talked earlier, once, now that we got the easements, or close to having all the easements signed on the dotted line, uh, we'll start in probably at next month's meeting, I'll have, we can get a schedule together to try to get this project out to bid and, and to get some bids on that. Um, we may actually, come, this may actually work to your benefit, but we're seeing some very, um, very good bid numbers coming on some projects in, in a recent month. So if we can get this thing out the door in the next months uh, <coughs> here, I think you're going to, you should get some numbers that will blow our original estimates. So that may actually have all the delays and that sort of thing on this project. It may actually come to be something good from a financial standpoint. So. Any questions? Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, Mayor. The uh, mayor is not here. I, mean, I guess he has no. He just won't let me know. To the board. He wanted me to let me know about the unfall study. Was it? Very good. Anybody else have anything come before the board tonight? No. 
I wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Got all this meeting adjourned.